Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Daisy, and today we're going horseback riding. But first, okay, so I want to give you guys a quick boob update. So if you guys don't know, I got my boobs done about six months ago in April with Dr. Gavami, and my results are amazing. I am so happy. It's one of the best decisions I feel like I've made. I really feel like it has made me feel so much more confident about myself, and I just feel more like a woman rather than like a little girl. Um, I know that it's all in my head. That is all mental. I just feel like my clothes fit me so much better. And I just feel like more comfortable in my own skin. So I wanted to give Dr. Kavami a huge shout out for making me feel more like a woman and more like my actual self. And also an update on the recovery process. I'm perfectly fine. I can lift as much weight, if not more, than before the surgery. So everything is great. I'm so, so happy with how they turned out. And I love you, Dr. Gavami. Um, if you guys have been looking for a good surgeon to do your boobs, definitely check him out. I am so happy. I would have, I can't even imagine I've gone going to anybody else. He's the best. But on another note, so we're going horseback riding and I'm gonna take you. And before that, I have a try-on haul. Ooh, so I'm gonna just do like a quick little try-on haul. I'm gonna try on all my lingerie I got from Gooseberry. I know you guys have been wanting this for so long. Well, you men. So my female followers just skip to the like horseback riding unless you wanna see the cute lingerie that I got. But my guys, my boys, I know you guys have been waiting for this. So you guys also have been nice to me in the comments lately. So you know like why not? Why not give you guys what you want? So for my dudes, the day has come. The day you have been waiting for. And I'm back. So this is the first one. I think it's super cute. I've worn this a couple times. I wore it in one of my Instagram photos, right? That one on my bed. And then I also wore the top for my Halloween costume recently. Um, I was like a flirty cowgirl, I don't really know. But anyways, this is the first set. Really, really cute. I love it. I feel like Cinderella. Love it. Cute like thong, cheeky back, and then lace bra. Love this part. Love the color. It matches my eyes. It compliments me quite well. Okay, now next one. Next one. Cute. I like this one a lot. It's quite, quite sexy. Um, I can't really show you this part because this is super, super see-through and you can see my nipples and I'm not about to show you guys that. Um, but the back is more like thong-like, as you can see. And yeah, it's just super, super cute. Ah, I can see my neighbors looking at me. You guys, I'm hiding. This is embarrassing. <laughs> I look like a... This does not look good. I'm literally like in a broad underwear, like trying on clothes in front of a camera. Like, this does not look good. Not show who I really am as a person. Ah! I'm embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. Okay, you know what? It's fine. Because I know that I am more than just a body. Hey, okay? I have personality. You guys love me for my personality and not my try on hauls. I know it. You have to. Like, there's just no way you don't. Like, okay, okay. You know what I'm thinking with? Fuck it. <laughs> this is cute. This is kind of like a, what would you call this? Like an emerald green, I would say. I think that's actually the name of the color on the line. But here it is. It's more like brief style in the back. Cute little netting. Really cute. The top is more of like a crop top, which I really like because I feel like it makes your waist look smaller. Yeah, I love this one. I also wore this one in an Instagram photo when I had brown hair. Right there. Cute. But next outfit. Okay, I'm back and in a different outfit. Still watching my neighbors look at me as I'm doing this, but it's okay. We're going to ignore that. This one's really, really cute. I think this is one of my favorites so far. You guys can see right here. It's very like wedding night. Like when I'm married, I'm gonna wear this. This is cute. It's like, I don't know, it's just like very, very like like sexy, cute, you know, innocent. Love it. Cute like song back. How many times can I say like in this video? I don't know. Ah there's people like you know. I swear I think that they're I think that they're like Snapchatting me. This is so embarrassing. You guys saw their Snapchat. I don't know if they like they're on social media, but if they're roasting me right now, fuck. <laughs> Anyways, this one's really cute. It's probably my favorite one. <laughs> so this one is super super cute, too It's kind of just like a cute little row. It's really really soft. It's like a pretty pretty pink like the color of your blush Um, it goes to about I don't know if you guys can see but like right here and This is just like a cute like in the morning like you don't really want to put any clothes on and you just want to like I don't know chill chill around your house, but this is what I'm gonna wear that for 
Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that little try on haul, but now we gotta go ride some horses. <laughs> really, really interesting how I decided to do a try on haul before I go horseback riding. Um, but let's go, this is gonna be fun, yay. Oh my God, another life update. I just had to drop out $3,500 on my car being service. Yay, so now I'm in a rental car because it's gonna take all week. That's so much fun. I love having a car. You know, like the idea of having a car or like a nice car is amazing until you have to realize that there are realities to it. It costs a lot of money. Insurance is a lot when you have a nice car, especially when you're young. The service and especially when you hit that like 40,000 mile service mark, that's the big one that's the big one and that's the one i'm paying for right now so that's not fun but got a cool rental car so we good we good on my way to go horseback riding we good i'm hungry probably gonna stop for some food i have a very important question what's up are we still going horseback riding hell look what i'm doing I'm We called them to make a reservation. We're about to go horseback riding today. I'm really excited. And then carve pumpkins. And then we're carving pumpkins tonight. So tune in. Oh yeah, and then we're going to party, right? Can I vlog? Oh yeah. Yay! Okay guys, whose eyes are better? Come here. Wait, they actually look the same. But I kind of look so weird because I'm looking Mine are up just like icy. <laughs> Pretty icy. Guys, I don't remember the last time I had a sandwich. Are you recording right now? Yeah, I'm recording. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up, guys? Closer, like level. Turn your eyes. Ready? Blue eye game. Where are you guys? Jimmy, I'm so excited. Are you ready? Yes, I'm so excited. Another red horse? Yeah. I hope you. I mean, I've done it a couple times. Usually I just like worked with them, that was it. We're going horseback riding. And In case you guys didn't know, this is what's happening. Yay. Oh my goodness. so cute. Just like you. Uh, what are you doing? Are you looking at horse penises? It's not a penis, that's a vagina. <laughs> that's a vagina? A vagina. <laughs> Guys, the tail's around me with Julia's hair. I don't know why. <laughs> Guys, look at the horses. Pay attention to me. You're cute. You're like an Oreo. I got some booty competition. Let's see. <gasps> you wanna like, say hi? You, oh, hi. Hello. Hi, sweetheart. <gasps> oh, what's your nose? Oh, hello, beautiful. Hi. Oh. <laughs> Guys, I have such a special connection to horses. I don't know why. Maybe I was a horse in a past life. Daisy's a cowgirl. I'm yeah, cowgirl. I'm Daisy, Daisy Duke. Come on. Say hi to me. Pay attention to me, please. Horsey. Hi. Oh. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, it looks like an Oreo milkshake or something. It's so cute. Hi! You speak their language. <laughs> Hello! All you guys are so am friendly. Am I the only one who sees that there's a goat walking around Hollywood? Yes, I saw that on Hollywood Boulevard. There's literally a goat that just walks around Hollywood, doesn't bother anybody. People and just come, pet it, and feed it. It stays on the sidewalk. Guys, comment below um, if you've seen this goat. Didn't... Right? Have you seen this goat? Have you? Can we make an Instagram for it? <laughs> oh, you guys are doing it! So cute! Such a good horsey. That way. You guys, I'm learning. I'm learning. Successful trip. Got a little bit of dirt on my face, but it's okay. God made dirt and dirt down here. <laughs> Did you have fun? Yeah. Did you? Oh, yeah. My legs hurt. A lot. My vagina hurts. Who else is talking to me? I feel better. So it's okay. Should I get a big one? What if I smash the pumpkin? Oh my god. 
All right, guys, I am so mad at myself. I lost all the footage to <laughs> carve my pumpkins because it wasn't recording, and I thought it was recording the entire time, but it didn't. So that's not gonna happen, I'm really sorry, but it was really fun, I made a cute little bat. But I am so tired, I had so much fun today, I'm so glad, like that was the most spontaneous like like horseback riding experience ever, like my friend just literally randomly called me and said, hey, you wanna go horseback riding? I'm like, hell yeah, let's go. So, um, I'm really grateful for that experience, and I'm really tired, I don't even know what I'm saying. But, but anyways, I love you guys so much, don't forget to check me out on all my socials, don't forget to go check out my booty programs if you guys are wanting to grow a keep speech. And my sweatshirts, my butt is real, linked in the description box below. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye! We found a way, we found a way. Yeah, we found a way.